So even regular sights, you can dial in the range. So now I'm going to show you a little bit of the expanded commander functionality for the game. In the original game, the commander could uh, call in artillery strikes, and that was, that was about it. So in the, uh, in the new game, we've added a lot more functionality for the commander. He has the ability to do uh, aerial recon, which I'll demonstrate now. And, uh, a plane will fly over the battlefield and spot enemy positions. Now the plane actually needs to have vision on the enemy to, uh, to detect them. So if they're inside a building, they won't see them. But as you see here, the red dots appearing on my, uh, on my map there are the enemy positions. Another thing that we've added is the ability to force respawn. In a wave-based game type like Territory, when your players are in a queue waiting to respawn, the commander can force them to spawn immediately. This is on a timer, so they can't do it all the time, but at key moments in the battle, they can force their, uh, their squad to get back into the battle faster. This can turn the tide of the battle. So as you see, my, my recon plane has spotted some enemy positions over in this village. So what I'm going to do is uh, mark a position with my binoculars, and now I'm going to drop artillery on that position. Now the original game, we had an artillery system, but it was limited to just one type of artillery strike. In the new game, we've expanded this to uh, not just the original artillery, but smaller strikes such as mortars, uh, less risk of doing uh, friendly fire damage, all the way up to huge uh, rocket strikes. For now, I'm just going to call in artillery and go watch the effects. Um, in the original game, the environment was static, so when artillery fell, it would kill players and vehicles, but it did nothing to the environment. For the new game, we've implemented a system we call our Massive Destruction System. This allows us to dynamically destroy basically any object in the game that we want to. This, this is about to be demonstrated with the artillery. As you see here, we're uh, damaging buildings and uh, blowing up fences. We can, uh, this entire system uh, also works online and multiplayer. And uh, now we could easily destroy everything in a level uh, like this, but for gameplay reasons, we're limiting the destruction to, a, to, a, to an extent. Just because if you have a completely flat level with nothing in it, it wouldn't be fun. So we keep some shells of the buildings and things like that. So uh, this concludes my presentation. I'll be happy to answer any questions that you guys have. Uh, it was so competent. <laughs> okay, no, no, no more questions. Okay. Looks great. Thank you.